Hey, have you ever thought of getting in the coaching industry? But you had no clue how to coach somebody? You had no clue how to get started? Well, I hear you. You're in luck today. Because today what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you or share with you great questions to use when coaching someone. Hey, I'm Mark Nelson. I'm a former high school teacher turned online business coach. And the reason being, I just saw a great way to impact a lot of people. But what else I saw is right now it's a $17 billion industry and expected to be $20 billion in the year 2022. See, what's happening is there are people out there that are looking for help, whether it's in business, relationships, health, you name it. There are so many places you can coach. But the key to coaching isn't telling, it's asking questions. So I'm going to share with you eight questions you can work with and ask people that you're talking to. Because I don't know about you, and you probably even ran into this in your life. When people come up and they say, man, I just don't know where I am. I'm stuck. Well, see, that's starting to get into coaching. So one of the first questions you can ask them is, well, tell me more about that. Or what do you mean about that? Because what you want them to do to do is you want them to explain themselves a little bit. And then you just follow it up when they start talking about it, you go, well, what happened? And then the next one, see all these kind of lead into each other and there's a lot more questions. I'll give you some in a free resource. It's gonna be a link down below. How do you feel about that? Right, so what you're doing is trying to get them to open up. And the next one is, well, how's that working for you? Because when people say some things, I mean, sometimes when you're a coach, you're going to hear some really funny things out there. And you really want them to understand, you know, well, that might not have been a really great decision for you. So it's, well, how's that working for you? The next one that you could use, what would perfect look like? I mean, aren't these great questions? I mean, can you, can you see them? Has anybody asked you those questions? But as you're listening to those, can you actually hear you asking those questions and people responding to them? Because again, what you want to do, you want them to get to open up to you. Now, this is a statement. Hmm. That's interesting. It's just a statement. Because you want them to actually know that you're listening and that they know that they're on to something else, right? Now, the seventh one is what would happen if, right? Because you're going into this conversation, what would happen if? And let them expand. Now, here is where things get interesting. May I offer you a suggestion? And you wait, get all these questions. You wait for the answer. There might be some uncomfortable spot, but you wait for them to answer you. May I offer you a suggestion? And if they say yes, great. If they say, well, no, well, then you don't give them a suggestion. That's all it is. Now, if they say something, yes, you can offer me a suggestion. Be careful. Don't say, well, if I were you, this is what I would do. Because they can come back at you. It's the same thing. You're going to ask one more question. What would happen if you try this? Because you want them to think, well, here's my suggestion. But what would happen if you try this? And let them say, oh, that's interesting. I might give that a shot. Now, if you're running the coaching business, right, in, in my mind, in my thought pattern, you should. That's where people are really heading to, and they all need help. But in running a coaching business, the last question you ask, where do we go from here? Because what you want to do, you want to get them in a 
different discovery call, you want to get them into your coaching program, whatever that coaching program is. Hey, I do have a bunch of free resources and I do have a discovery call. You can give me a call at, and we'll just talk. It's at marknelsononline.com forward slash call. marknelsononline.com forward slash call. Hey, if you're watching this on YouTube, hit that subscribe button, that little bell so you get notifications. I have great videos coming out. If you're listening to this on my podcast, just follow. I would love it if you'd go to Apple's podcast, Apple's iTunes, whatever they call that thing, and give me a review. And of course, I like a five-star review because that helps me get more stuff out. I don't put ads, ads in my podcast. I don't put ads in my YouTube videos yet. But that helps me grow. Thanks. Y'all take care. My suggestion. Become a coach.